Are you ready to get divorced but still living with your spouse? This is what you need to know before moving out. My name is Laura D. Hurd, and I am an attorney who practices family law in San Antonio, Texas, and I've been practicing for more than 30 years. People come to me all the time and ask whether it's okay to move out of their house while divorce is pending or before filing for divorce because they're afraid that they will either be seen as at fault in the divorce or um, as having abandoned the marital home because they moved out first. Here are some things that you need to consider. First of all, is there any domestic violence in the relationship? If a woman is trying to break away from an abusive partner, that is the most dangerous time for her. You need to plan very carefully. There is help available at the Battered Women's Shelter to make a plan before you move out so that you can do so with as little conflict as possible. Talk to your attorney about whether you need a protective order and whether that protective order should be ordering him to stay away from the house or allow you to leave the house without telling him where you are. Then, secondly, think about the kids. If you have children, you wanna take them with you if there's any domestic violence in the situation. Take your kids and your pets with you. But you also want to think about if there's not domestic violence in the situation, do you want to leave the home and take the kids into a new school and a new home when there's so much change happening with the divorce. Above all, you need to always do what's best for the kids. And if the best thing for the kids is for the, the spouse who's going to maintain custody to keep the kids in the marital home with them, then that is what you should do and encourage the other spouse to move out of the home. If the other spouse refuses to move out of the home, then there are some things that we can do that you need to come in and talk to an attorney about. But we have no fault divorce in Texas, so don't worry about being considered the spouse at fault in the divorce or the fault of the breakup of the marriage for moving out. Even though there is a ground for divorce for abandonment, there's two requirements for that. One is that you have to have remained away for at least a year. And secondly, you have to have intended to abandon the property. And there is no reason for you to say that you intended to abandon the house just because you moved out of the house. In Texas, we have community property, regardless of whose name is on the deed. If the house was purchased during the marriage, it's presumed to be community property. And so, if um, it is community property, then um, you have not given up your ownership just because you moved out of the house. The judge can still order one party to move out, another party to move in, and can order that the house be sold and the money divided. You haven't given up your right to own the house just because you moved out of the house. I hope this helps. If you have any questions, call me for a consultation.